Hello, it's the Dazzling One, teaching tips and tricks to the everyday girl. I'll get your gorgeous to you. In today's video, I have been on a quest to find the most apply, best value lashes. So, brands that I'm going to review, how easy they are, and explain what my final thoughts are on each one. So, let's get started. So as you heard, I'm going to be reviewing a few magnetic lashes that I've tried. It's been a interesting journey to find the best lash. The first one I'm going to tell you about is Luxzilla. Okay, I got these off of Amazon. I think I paid about $15 and I have Prime so the shipping was included. So basically you get five magnetic lashes in here. You get a, a tool to help you apply them and I've used them so you can see there's a little bit of glue I mean not glue liner on them so those are the five different pairs that you get and it comes with its own eyeliner and it tells you to shake it up really good then to apply the liner to your eyelid it says shake the liner well before using and make sure that your eyeliner is a hundred percent dry before clicking on your lashes you can test your liner by touching it to make sure that nothing comes off then you know it's dry uh, magnetic lashes from kiss and um, I made a mistake of buying this one uh, from them and this one is crowd pleaser which I absolutely love I had to use another type because I didn't realize that it didn't come with the liner so it's pretty much the same thing. It says line with KISS magnetic liner along your lash line and wait until it's dry. Lash right onto the applied eyeliner. So it also gives you a little tip if the lashes are too long that you can cut all the way, you know, cut to where the next magnet is. So that way you don't have anything that's kind of hanging off. It'll be my first time trying this liner. And then my next one that I'm going to try, that I'm going to show you is the Adele. And these are, they're magnetic lashes as well. They're Demi, I've tried them so that's why they're not in place. They are Demi Wispies and they come with a gel liner which was super easy to use. Again, I'll tell you all of my thoughts on all of them at the end. So one eye, I'm going to use the, I'm going to apply one of the Luxilla lashes. And then the other one, I'm going to apply a Dell eye. So they're going to look a little weird because it's going to be two different ones. Then I'm going to remove them and then I'm going to apply the Kiss Lashes and um, let you see all three. One other thing I want to share with you is I did purchase from Adele these and a lot of brands have these where they're the upper and the lower and you use a tool. This was extremely hard to use so I'm not going to show this one or review it but um, I, I got to practice with it a little bit more but I know the whole premise of the magnetic lashes that is supposed to be something that's super quick, super easy and you don't have the glue and you don't have to deal with any of that and it's easy to take off. And so then apply it. Here's the brush so you can see, okay? Apply it. Oh. Like you would if you had, we're just applying Logler eyeliner. And then we're gonna let that dry. And I'm gonna show you to show you a pod and it comes with a little brush which is really cool I love that liner because it reminds me of my Mary Kay gel liner it, as far as it's easy it's just really easy to apply so we're going to let those dry and then I'm going to come back and we're going to apply okay, the lashes. Okay, now that they both have dried and applied a second uh, coat of the gel liner from Ardell, as, it, as the instructions tell us, I'm going to apply one of the five pairs of lashes 
and the lash right there in the little tool and I'm just gonna apply it okay cool thing about the mag magnetic lashes over regular false eyelashes is you're able to kind of pull them off and, and readjust them if they're not laying the way you want them to so that that's one thing I really like about them that's right so that is the Xilla's lash see that's pretty easy here's a lash there you just kind of apply it with your hand or you can use a tweezers if you want having the best luck today. Straight. It's tough to see without the glasses. Usually I have a magnifying mirror that kind of helps me. So there is the Luxilla Lash and Liner. And then this one is the Ardell Demi Wisp with the Gel Liner. So now to take them off, and I've worn them both all day, so I know how they kind of work. Now to take them off, you just simply, you know, go to the end and you just pull them right off. And you want to keep them in your in their little trays because that's going to extend the life. I don't know how great I had that one on because I can't see very well, but that's going to extend the your. Now to remove the liner, I'm going to simply use my Mary Kay oil-free eye makeup remover and a cotton ball and gently take it off um, and the cool thing about it is that there's no pulling there's no tugging it they, they do both liners do gently come off thing I wanted to share too is you know I kind of been have been testing the Luxilla ones for a little bit they're trying to get really get the hang of how I could do them really fast what I did was I took a cup like from using them so much it has a little bit of liner on it is I took just a little paper uh, plastic cup and I put a little bit of this oil free makeup remover in there and I put drop them in there and let them sit for a few minutes swishing around a little bit and then I just took a paper towel and it wiped it right off so then that's going to even extend them even further back and now we're going to try the kiss lashes and I'm going to shake up I'm going to shake up here it's almost like a nail polish where it has that little ball in it but I'm shaking it up and then I'm going to apply the lashes and these are tempt the crowd pleaser has really been my favorite I've been rocking those ones and just loving them loving the look of them so, but I had to use a different uh, liner. So this is the first time I'm using this one. It has a similar line, liner brush like the Luxilla. So I'm gonna apply that. Very easy, easily. the liner I'm gonna put that back in its tray I love keeping everything together if it came with something I put it back the way it came Let that dry okay for I'm a back second. now that it is dry to now take the lashes out and then I'm gonna apply it, it dried really fast which is great if you especially like if you're rushing in the morning or something one thing I like to do with ones that I just have, that I haven't used is just kind of bend them a little bit it just seems to help them like adhere better to your eyes. Wow, oh, that one went on pretty good, huh? <laughs> wow, look at that. That's incredible. It's not the lash, it's me because I'm having trouble seeing, but with, for not very well, I'm doing pretty good, I think. 
So that tells you just how easy some of these are. There. And you can always kind of just go back if you feel like you didn't get it all the way down, like all the ma magnets connected. And these fit my eyes perfectly, so I don't think I need to do any cutting. Usually I'll use like the back of um, and the applicator and just kind of just press them down. But I got them on and so that's that. That is incredible, huh? So that is the Kiss Lashes, uh, magnet Magnetic Lashes and it, they're in Tempt. Wow, that's incredible. Fabulous. <laughs> so uh, let me tell you my review. So when I first got the Lux Luxzilla lashes, they were very hard to use. Okay, um, and and it was because I had never used any before. But once I got the hang of them, and two of the pairs I kind of cut down because they were too a little too long for me. They were fine. They were very. They were fine. Um, then I said, you know, what, let me try some other brands and. So I've been seeing there's there's some that are like a hundred bucks and, and or more and these ones here all of the ones I showed you today ranged anywhere from like six seven bucks all the way up to like 15 or 16 bucks and that's not doesn't include tax wherever you're at or anything like that but the cool thing about it is they 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 wear just they wear fine they wear just fine I would love to try some of those and I was kind of tempted to to try some of the more expensive ones thinking maybe that would make it better but these work just fine you know so you know maybe I will eventually but I love these I love all of them and the Adele um, I I love I love the pod gel liner um, and, and I love um, the lashes I just wish I would have got maybe a more bolder lash but uh, as far as the application they all apply really easily you know you just really want to make sure you some brands I noticed they, they say let it dry completely some say you know let it dry a little and then apply from other ones that I kind of messed around and fooled with and tried but these were the three top ones that I really liked Zilla so the top for me would be tie between Ardell and Kiss and then Luxilla's the third so I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you found it fun and informative. Have a wonderful day. Remember, like, comment, and subscribe. And if you want to know what's coming out, when it comes out, click the notification bell. Have an awesome day. Bye-bye.